day, the stuff mart was everything the salesman had made it out to be. Why, the spectacle was making her woozy. I am feeling woozy. And rightfully so. Well, madam, shall we shop? This was the most glorious moment that Madame Blueberry had ever known. There was nothing she saw she could not have. Right away she found flatware just like Monsieur Legoon's, and then a sparkling new set of Franklin Mint Spoons. Then she spotted a crockpot like Madame Le Crosses, and some ceramic jars to hold our hot sauces. Not to mention a sofa like Edward and Tammy's and an entire collection of terry cloth jammies. It was not long before Madame Blueberry had collected everything she had pictures of. She had already filled up a dozen shopping carts, but she did not stop there. She kept going. Madam, why don't we have these things delivered to your house while you keep shopping? It'll save time. 10% off delivery. Oh, all right. That sounds good. I don't know if that's such a good idea. Oh, look. Air compressors. Then she grabbed a window scraper and a gross of toilet paper. Then a ratchet set and fires and surround sound amplifiers. Pretty soon, the shopping carts made them feel stretched around the aisles, out the door, and all the way to her house. for me. What do you say we head home? Oh, there are whole aisles we haven't even seen yet. No, I'm not leaving until I have everything I need to be happy.